Ethan, get your ass in here. My Smack ass? that ass for the thing. Ready? <laughs> wow. Ouch. Once upon a time, in an old English country of Scottsdale, Arizona, there was a man who dreamed a dream to take the previously made invention of pancakes and turn it into something incredibly new and interesting and zesty. He made Mickey Mouse, which wasn't to be invented for another 400 years, into a pancake shape. And with that, he created a new era of pancake consumption, which was a time-honored tradition among the pagans of Eastern Europe. But from then on, we decided that it was time for us to revive this lost art of pancake art. But I can't do it alone. I need my friends. Or whatever is nearest them will do to substitute friends. Tyler the Apocalypse Shy. Known for his devastating flipping capabilities. If he were to flip at 100% capacity, he would annihilate the entire universe. Cause untold destruction across the land. He was known once to flip so hard it cracked the very crust of the ocean, causing untold destruction. You remember Noah's flood? Pfft, more like Tyler's fist. And also, Ethan the Crust Nester. If you were to even question anybody who has the greatest, crispiest, goldenest crust in the world, it would be Ethan. There is no telling to how good that crust can be. Contents of the pancake aside, it might be bad. The crust, the flakiness, the bitterness, the crispiness cannot be beaten on any scale. And you may be wondering who I am among these titans of pancake. Well, I can't believe you don't recognize me. Maybe not with this face. It's me, Markiplier. Mark... M Mark Mr. Butterworth Frischbach. Oh yes, that's true. If you were wondering what made that syrup so thick and juicy, it was 100% me, baby. From... I <laughs> 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 not, not laugh! Do you know why there's a national recycling program for these? Because they send it to my house for refilling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, covering every single pancake out there in existence. It's 100% me. <laughs> So let's get started with this trio of perfection. How can things go wrong? Only when we're pitted against each other in mortal combat. Yes. Each in our own right, legendary among the pancake professionados. But we are here to bring this home to another level of pancake. We're gonna take your suggestions and your suggestions alone to make the greatest, best, fantasticest, mysticalist pancakes in existence, and who, mm, soever, makes, and whom, soever, makes the greatest, best, most accurate pancake to your desires, wins. So let's get started. Shall we? Shan't we? We shall. We shall. We shall. We're going in raw, unprotected. <laughs> We're not using recipes. We're not using measuring cups. We've been doing this for thousands of years. We know exactly what to do with these ingredients here to make the best pancake possible. And you may be wondering, oh, where's the spoons? <laughs> These are my spoons. Spoons. <laughs> spoon. Spoon. Uh, spoon. These are my spoons. Spoon. 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 Each of us will have three minutes to make the best batter that we can. No buttermilk here, unfortunately. Don't know why no one's wanting me to make buttermilk pancakes. They don't want me to win. Count it down. Three, two, one, go. Usually, as my dad would have done this, he would have put this in the fridge overnight, uh, you know, to fully mix and, you know, rise a bit, but, you know, we're going without it. Going a little bit, you know, off the, uh, off the farm. Two eggs, more like, more like the incredulous shied. Uh, Whoa. <laughs> Sorry for oiling your pit there. Oh, it's fine, dude. <laughs> it's fine, dude. 
I got oil in pits for days, dude. All right, so as you can see, my opponents here unintelligibly went for two eggs, uh, when obviously you should only use one egg. You don't want to, you want, you don't want too gluey a pancake. The more protein you have in there, the more it's gonna stick. You want a fluffy pancake. Right. Gotta go light on the mix. Mario Bar set to low and oh fuck god stop. <laughs> Those are my settings. How's the time? You have a minute ten. Easy! Yeah. We got this cha, cha, cha. We used to make pancakes in our sleep. So you may be wondering, oh this doesn't seem so bad. Oh, we're gonna be judged on taste, composition, and accuracy to the prompt. That's how we're gonna be judged. May I taste your batter? No. One finger? Not at all. You can't taste my batter on a boat. You can't taste my batter on a moat. No! <laughs> oh no! Too much sugar! Oh, that's a good squeeze of sugar. And spoons down! Spoons down! All right, I think I made the most batter. Yeah, that's yeah. not the best batter. It's the very best. It's about to be in quality over quantity. Well, you need to food color it. Yeah, <laughs> just like with YouTube, it's <laughs> not about quantity of videos. It's about it's quality. It's about quality. Mm -hmm. That's the mark of order. Okay, do we get to wash yeah. our hand now? No! no! What are you stupid with your stupid hat? What, have you never made pancake before? Have you never made pancake? Don't you dare put yeah. that the back in your bowl, bitch. Batman doesn't take no crime. Batman won't take it. No! Who's ready for this? I'm ready. So, we're bringing the squeeze! I'm so, Tyler to... needs the girthiest bottles. We get the, you know, conservative go flow ocean bottles. Are you sure I can't go watch that? No! You wipe! Oh, wipe a, wipe a big boy. <laughs> oh my god, that was like exactly my dick. <laughs> so, we've also got food coloring for uh, stupidity. Don't know why that's there. Whoever had that idea was a dumb. Bring in the griddle! No, not you. Oh, well, sorry. I, should we spray it down? Give it a good spritz? Spray yourself, you bitch. Should I spray it? Give you, it a good spray. You are. <laughs> 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 just. We're totally <laughs> Yes, even spray it. You are the crust after all. Whoa. Technical. This is why he's a master. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus <laughs> Christ. So dude. much. This is why he's the master. If you question the master, you get bit in the ass. Mm. That's the deal. If you like getting bit in the ass, ask a lot of questions. If you don't, Shut the fuck up. All right, so what we need is we need your suggestions right now. Right in the comments, right now. No, we have to color first. Color? Color our back. I'm not coloring until it gets on the griddle. Mm -hmm. Where's my spatch? You have to be Here's your spatch. Thank you. Uchi. Here's my spatch. Shit. That's Tyler's spatch. Don't touch. Don't touch his spatch. Touch tip. Touch tip, touch tip our tip. No. Oh. Forbidden love. Forbidden love. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh fuck, casual sex is crazy. <laughs> All right, it's back on. We've got our squeeze. We've got to squeeze for real good. If we don't squeeze good, we die. Ready? Let's do one squeeze together, ready? No. No? Okay. You squeeze by yourself. Back in 1824, there were 13 people in the small town of Salem, Oregon. They thought someone was a witch because they made a pancake art just in the exact representation of Satan himself. <laughs> yes. Sizzling with anticipation, they they cast the witch into the local lake. This, and, but as soon as she touched the water, suddenly the entire lake turned to syrup. And this is how the most famous witch of all, Mrs. Butterworth, came into being. All right, let's. Go. Courage the cowardly dog. We're just rolling into that after that yeah. bullshit story. Yeah, let's, we are. No, let's not. Shit story. That was a. That was that's that's my wife. wife. That's my wife. Let's do this. Ready? Courage. The cowardly. By who? The uh, the former Stinson. Ready? Ready? Set. Go. Bombs away. Bombs away. 
Well, that's not good. <laughs> it would really help if I remembered what Kirk's the Cowardly Dog looked like. He looks like a fucking dog. <laughs> he didn't look like a fucking dog. What do you mean he didn't? I look watched like the freaking he's show. He's very much like a fucking dog. If I'm not, if I'm, if I'm to be mistaken here. Mine is corrupted. Mine is corrupted. Corrupted. Someone has has tainted my bottle. Oh, oh fucking no! Ah, there we go. Flip. Got it. flip. Execute the perfectly. It's okay, courage. Shh, shh, shh. It's God, okay now. Live up to your name. Only dreams. No nightmares. Do, 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 do. Mine's done. Dude, you, you got in the crypt. <laughs> I know. What is that? <laughs> what is that? Who? Cool. Time to flip. Dude. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> Courage, no! Courage, no! As you can see... <laughs> that's Kirby! <laughs> Actually decent Kirby! <laughs> you made a surprisingly good Kirby! Kirby the cowardly dog. What? <laughs> you, didn't, you didn't even make a pancake! I did! It oh, tastes great! So as you can see, courage, courage, Kirby. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? Not so bad! Not so bad. Um We'll, uh, we'll, 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 uh, we'll judge this later. That's the initial first look. We're gonna fill out our plate with multiple things. Um, you're just gonna have pancakes. <laughs> At good choice with Tyler the Apocalypse Shide. He knows that Kirby is the most destructive force known to man. And in all video game world, there is no one more sinister and more devastating than Kirby. All right, what is our next suggestion? Squidward. 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 That's a really good Squidward look. Thanks. We'll see how it turns when I, if I can flip this thing. I may need to borrow someone's spatula. Yours looks really good too bad. <laughs> mine is not, my stuff is not coming out of the freaking bottle. Whoa. Whoa. Careful, don't go on top of mine. Oh shit. Shit, shit, shit. Get more! Shit, sorry. God. Sorry. Damn it. I've ruined yours. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. That's like you're making an omelet. <laughs> just wait I until it's it done. It was you. His oh is my too god. Liquid. Oh yeah, it's yours is. That's, that's your. Liquid. That's your main problem. Your batter is off. <laughs> it's straight up like dog vomit. <laughs> yours looks so good. Thanks. Oh, Tyler, how do mine look? <laughs> like I just took a bath. <laughs> oh, consistent. Is so consistent. I had a hard time because my my. Stuff isn't coming out of my oh, Right, wait. right, right. Tyler, flip yours around. No! Just squid oh, yeah, if you, if you flip <laughs> around, it's like the exact same thing. Mine are consistent, and so are yours. And uh, mine are Squidward and Courage the Cowardly Dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So are mine. So, uh, yeah, that was pretty good. Last one? Mm -hmm. I had no idea how to draw Squidward. I'm bad from memory. All right, what is the last challenge? Homer Simpson. Homer Simpson. Simpson. No, I'll do Homer. Homer. Ace, Ace Simpson? A Simpson. Mark. I'll do Homer. Okay. Peaceful time. Making pancakes with you guys. Mm. Let's relax. Mm -hmm. no, good change from our normal fucking insane things that we do. I just want to take the time to say that I really love making videos with you guys. And, like, it's, it's, it's some of the greatest joys of my week to be able to come together and watch you fail and you succeed, but in the wrong way. I like how you're using your finger to draw. <laughs> it's really inspiring. You know, you may fail, but you fail in, 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 in a wonderful way. Oh, thank you. <sighs> you're really good at making pancakes. <laughs> I love making pancakes. But one of the, one of the most cherished times uh, when I was growing up was, um, my dad made pancakes every single Sunday, and he loved pancakes. He, he, it was like a cherished tradition of ours every Sunday morning. We'd have pancakes and he would start preparing them on Saturday. Cause he would have them sitting overnight in the, uh, in the, uh, in, in the fridge. You know, just kind of like cooking and getting ready. And they were just the best pancakes. I've never had any other pancake from any other place that was nearly as good as my dad's pancakes. That's Ethan's. Mine. Uh, pretty good, I think. My first attempt at making art. I've never made pancake art before, so. I like how you didn't use any color. 
Yeah, I, well, I mean, that's how like traditional pancake curry is done. Is like you you have to use the amount of cook. Well, that's not bad. I can definitely see it. It's got thick outline. I think over. my issue was the batter that I made. Yeah, your batter was shit. Well, it was. I was trying to fill it in, yeah. and it's hard when I don't have the squeeze to fill I it in. I think you had the right amount of like baking soda because yours are thicker. Mine's are a bit thin. Probably will be a bit chewy, but mine are, uh, mine are just right. <laughs> yours are perfect. The crust on yours. Woo! So it comes down to this. There are three categories of judgment. Number one, quality of the pancake itself. Outside of art, how does it taste? Is it close to a pancake? Number two, how close is the art to the actual thing that it was supposed to be? Like if it is Courage, Homer, and Squidward, how close <laughs> were they to the actual inspiration? And number three, taste. How does it taste? Which tastes the best, bar none, what tastes the best? Okay, makes sense, and that's how we're gonna need it. But we have impartial judges. <laughs> Who's tasting the pancakes? We no, because we're fine. Wait, no, there are three pancakes, one for each of us. We trade out which one to which. You can have courage. Mm -hmm. I'll take your courage. <laughs> you can have Squidward. <laughs> you, you trade you with my Squidward. Squidward. Mm -hmm. And Homer. Uh, wait, sorry. Uh, no, this one. This one. <laughs> <laughs> and now this works out. So we've each got one of these. We'll start out with artistic interpretation. Like, which one do you guys think was closest to the art? So, Mark. Uh, this is courage. We're starting with courage. Starting with courage. Courage. I, I, I'm voting. I'm voting Mark just based upon the plate. Yeah. I. I really wish I could see courage out of this one, but I just see Kirby. Mm -hmm. There's a little Squidward there. <laughs> oh my God! That's that's an amazingly good Squidward in there. <laughs> Oh man, if this was Squidward, I would say like Squidward in the middle of a pink forest, but no, I, I gotta give it to myself too. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, for Squidward! <laughs> Obviously it's between Mark and me, and Mark is definitely the winner. Uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, I don't know I about this man. Mmm, this smells like Squidward! <laughs> So Homer Simpson, mm -hmm. I actually got to give a, a little credit to this one. I could see Homer because what I was trying to do is I was you were doing the same thing. I was trying to make that mouth is brown and I was trying to make that different. I can see the mouth distinctly better. It just seems like the rest of it got a little. I, I, I overflowed it mm -hmm. at the end, all. But Ethan's, <laughs> Ethan's. Yeah. I mean, you can see the good. eye right yeah. there. Yeah. The mouth, uh. the anger, the drinking yeah. problem. Like, uh, I can you see. You did it. a good job with the hair on yours. I gotta give you props for that. Well, thank you. I didn't know if that would turn out. But I think, good. I think overall, Mark wins the artistic oh, category. Thank 100 percent. Thank you. So by texture, though, and I think that we'll just go overall on this one because mm -hmm. it was just the batter. The batter's the same. Mm -hmm. I gotta give it to Tyler. Because this is more light. Yeah. It looks more like a pancake. Mine are very thin. His is pancake-like. Mine are very. Uh, but <laughs> <laughs> again, we gotta like look this, at Ethan's. This reminds me of like crepe. Crepe thinness. <laughs> it's extra eggy. This is a thick. Not, 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 not that one. Squidward's a thick. I'm going, I'm going with this one. Like the crispiness. Like, yeah, yeah, that's, he is yeah, the that's crust. Like the it's even the, the You are crust. very <laughs> close to me. I would give it to Tyler for the pancakeness yeah. of I, this. I agree. He's got the batter down. Yeah. Now, here comes the hard part. Taste. Taste. Right. We have to try it without syrup and then with syrup. Okay, well, we're, we're just gonna go through each person's. I think that we should do a blind taste test. We'd know. We'd know. <laughs> we would totally know. All right, take it. All right, cheers. Cheers. Clinkies. It's very sweet. It was very sweet. Okay. Very sweet. I do appreciate it. It's light. It's fluffy. It is fluffy. Like, it's not bad. Mm -hmm. Got nice crisp to it. It's not a bad one. It's just weird because, like, in the middle, it's kind of <laughs> goopy. Mine is that. You just have the thick one. I have the thick one, yeah. But this is not bad. This one. I, I just don't mind this. I do not mind It this. is pleasant. It is mm -hmm. not bad. Mm -hmm. Not pancake, but I would, I would oh, yeah. eat it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. To Mark? All right, let's try me. It was a little bit bland. A little bland. Definitely a little but bland. But definitely pancake tasting. Mm -hmm. Like texture. Mm -hmm. This is the one that could use syrup. Like, you, yeah. you yeah. definitely want syrup. This is definitely a syrup one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Pancakey. Mm -hmm. Not as sweet, which may or may not be good, but in my mind, uh, I still like even better. All right. So All right. we got a little sweet, a little bland. Will Tyler be right in there? It's a little chewy. Mm -hmm. A little chewy. I would say, just a little chewy. It's got a good flavor. Not bad, yeah. It's sweeter than mine. Chewy, but 
It's like, it didn't fluff quite enough. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be fluffier just because of the way it is, but it turned out thicker. Mm -hmm. Not bad, but weirdly enough, I gotta give it to Ethan. I, I do too. It tastes good. It looks bad. It tastes good. Like, it is, guys. Yeah. That's a point for everybody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a point for everyone. We all win. We're all winners. Guys. I already eat my pancakes, though. I like I would eat mine, but I'm eating these. I'm eating these. It's cool. Mm -hmm. Legitimately good. It was all that sugar that <laughs> made it boom! Yeah. That's <laughs> oh. that yeah. super blast. Mm. I think it all tastes good. No? Yeah. I think we all are winners in our own way. Mm -hmm. I had the artistic interpretation. You had the pancakey look and feel of it. And you had taste overall. Mm -hmm. I like it. That worked out really well. I mean, not every competition has to end in bloodshed and terror. No. I've been ever stabbing with a spatula. <laughs> Thanks, Tyler. <laughs> Thank you for that. Oh, that means so much to me. So anyway, uh, that is the end of the pancake challenge. We hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, we had a lot of fun making it. We had a lot of fun doing this. And uh, from Ethan the Crust Nester to Tyler the Apocalypse, the 12 Apocalypses, <laughs> Shy, and me, Mark Mr. Butterworth Fishbach. And I expect Excellent fan art of that <laughs> name in the future. If so you anyway. guys want to make pancakes, pancake oh, yeah. art, mm -hmm. we would love to see it. Mm -hmm. Send it to us. Uh, tag us Instagram, Twitter. Mr. Butterworth. Put it in the comments. Yeah, so just let us know if you guys want to do this. It's really easy to do. You just get a squeeze bottle, put pancake mix, and just time it out. So, either way, thank you everybody so much for watching. And as always, we will see you in the next video. Bye! Bye! Bye.